What's up guys, it's Harwin, and I'm out here exploring Buddha Park, eating live shrimp salad, and watching my dad reunite with his childhood friends of 40 plus years. So stay tuned. Bang, bang, bang. Here comes the Aqua family picks in three, two, one. We can just stand by each other. We can touch like this. Okay. Being this huge and slightly injured, it doesn't help that this country caters to people half of my size. I'm injured, man. We are met with my father's childhood friend, who he hasn't seen in 40 plus years, and he asked me right off the bat, how the hell did I get so big? Now it's time to experience a meal with me, unlike any other. Damn, yo, we on a boat right now. They ain't let me drive it, but they gonna let me eat like crazy, man. First off, I got their lychee smoothie. Super sweet, but man, it's like 100 degrees out, and we in the shade. We about to eat like an animal. This is a traditional Lao dish called jumping shrimp. It's a dish that contains live baby shrimp, and when it's hit with the lime juice, peppercorns, and fish sauce, the shrimp reacts to the acidity, and they basically jump for their lives. Yeah, look at this. <laughs> Damn, yo, that tastes so good, man. <laughs> Got that fresh baby shrimp. Still jumping in the air. I'm gonna try a little bit. Got the Thai chili peppers, toasted rice powder, a little bit of fish sauce, and a bunch of greens. Can't beat that. Mm. Mm. As exotic as this dish may look, it doesn't taste like much. It only tastes like the seasonings put into it. Damn. The shrimps only add a complex level of texture to it. Gooey and crunchy. That tastes very good. Got that fresh tiger shrimp right off the Mekong River, freshly grilled. Look how big that is. Yeah. Yaipo. Oh my god. And this is a healthy serving too. We at least got 20 of these shrimps on each plate. All that head butter, all those juices, Look at that. so damn good. People missing out on the best part. The best part of the shrimp is always in the head. Usually I peel off the shell. I'm kind of too lazy right now to do it. But the shell adds so, so much flavor. That toastedness from being grilled, man, that charred, smoky flavor, people missing out on eating it. Can't beat this meal right now. We're right in the middle of the Mekong River, enjoying the view, enjoying the food. My dad's with his friends who he hasn't seen in 40 plus years. My parents are having the time of their life right now. Can't beat that shit, man. Once in a lifetime experience. Look at that. Look at that. Oh shit. 
Man, people don't eat these claws either. The way I think about it, it's the chip of the river. I still reveal a little bit of meat in there too. Man, look at all that. All that had meat in there. Mm. Now break this off. Look at that. Mm. So good, man. And just use your finger. Flick that out. That, that's called the natural head butter, man. And look at that. You see that small char on the shell? All flavor. It's like a mini lobster you're eating. Mmm. <laughs> Damn. And if you're wondering what happened to me, man, my dumbass got in a motorcycle accident. <laughs> With the meal this appetizing paired with the view this gorgeous, it was hard not to catch the itis. <laughs> like any loud party, we gotta celebrate with that karaoke. <laughs> Yo, I just want to give a huge thank you to everyone who's watching right now. You guys just saw me take down some exotic delicacies that I thoroughly enjoy. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. You guys got to experience one of the most amazing things that I've seen my dad reuniting with his friends who he hasn't seen in 40 years. 40 years. So you could just imagine the time that he was having. Uh, an amazing experience. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Smash that like button, subscribe if you haven't already. Uh, follow me on Instagram and Twitter at Social Harmonism. And yo, sale coming up soon. I know I thought I retired, but yo, the heat shelf. Stay tuned, bang, bang, bang.